Hello, today we have a video walkthrough tour of 11201 South State Highway 83. It's here in Franktown. As you can see, that's State Highway 83. We're out here in a rural area. This is a very interesting piece of property. It's the old schoolhouse, heritage listed. It's been converted into a residence. Let's go and take a look. It's a two bed, one bath, 1,211 square foot home. And as we navigate down here, we're coming through the front door and we'll finish our tour out through the back. And I'll talk a little bit more about the property once we get inside out of the noise. So this property is heated with a gas forced furnace. There is no central AC and the water supply is a well. Uh, the well has just been completely serviced and replaced. It is running fantastic. Ah, it's a bit better. So here we are in the kitchen and the laundry. Washer and dryer not provided. We have our kitchen here with our pantry. Refrigerator, stove, oven range, dishwasher, microwave. It's a brand new stove, brand new dishwasher, new cabinetry, and some older cabinetry there. We've got our storage. This uh, property is heated on propane, as you can see. And she's got some beautiful views. As I was saying outside, I'm not sure if the traffic noise made it hard to hear, but yeah, this is an old heritage listed schoolhouse that's been turned into a residence. So, other history, very cool. We've got a wood burning stove here as an additional source of heat, hardwood floors, and this is our bathroom, only bathroom in the unit. As you can see, toilet, tub, shower combo. And being a two bed, one bath, this would be our second bedroom. So this home would be fantastic for a contractor. We've got a Quonset hut on the property. We've got some storage, shipping containers. And then we have a second residence, which also uh, is on propane and a separate well, although there will be some additional finishes required to get it habitable. We can go down and take a look in a bit. So this is our bedroom upstairs. some cattle down there so that Jeep will be removed from the property as well as that little ride on lawnmower that's also a snow plow and a snow blower and then we have our secondary residence there up the back there's our storage container then our Quonset hut So a nice spacious bedroom up here. Got some clothes storage in there. In this room we have our utility closet and our furnace and some storage. Uh, this house has all new carpet and paint. And those couple of new appliances that we looked at. Oh, 
windy here today as well. jerky camera work. So these are the boundaries of the property here. Look at that side fence there. Running along the back. And then the border of the property runs along that high dwelling. Hopefully we can get this open without too much trouble. Just a just a, your standard storage uh, workshop. It's uh, you know powered. Uh, just a big cavernous space in there. And as you can see, the other side. Of it. It's quite great for storage or have a, have a shop or something like that. And if that's locked, I dare say this will probably be locked as well. Facility. It also has power and water. Uh, this, as well as the concert hut, was being used to grow marijuana. Um, approved, you know, no problems there, but the tenant's plans have changed and, and so he no longer had a need and, and uh, decided to move on. So could be uh, fitted uh, for a marijuana grow or used as a workshop, storage, whatever uh, suits. And last and perhaps least is the secondary unit, which we'll go take a look at here. As you can see, we've got some issues here. So we would have to replace windows. But depending on the right tenant, um, you know, we'd be willing to make that investment or perhaps the tenant would uh, be willing to do the work as well. So we've got a living room here. Portable AC in the in the wall. We've got a smaller storage room here. Here's our, our laundry utility room. Our kitchen. Again, significant work needed, and that would all be up for debate. And we have a hot water heater. Hot water is good, it does work. There's our secondary entrance. And then we've got a three quarter bathroom in here. So uh, everything is uh, negotiable. We're looking for the right type of tenant that's going to utilize this space and uh, get value out of it. Happy to answer any questions and discuss matters. So this has been 11201 South State Highway 83. It's a two bed, one bath uh, property in the singular dwelling. And uh, it's an old schoolhouse that's been converted. We have on the property as well the concert hut in the back storage back here and this secondary dwelling that could be finished. For more information
information or to schedule a tour, give us a call 303 930 5125.